Hello all viewers and aspirants. Welcome back. This is an 8 chapter production and my name is Devashish. In many exams, clock problems are a popular set of questions and often many struggle with this. The questions generally ask about the angle between the minute hand and an hour hand at a specific time. In this video, we are going to look at how to find the angle between the hands of the clock and also the angular speeds of the hands of a clock. Okay, so let us start with the question first. Find out the angle between the clock hands at 40 minutes past 5. Pause for some time. Think about the answer. Okay, if you are struggling to get the answer, keep watching the video to learn how. So let us first see what is the angular speed of a minute hand. Minute hand is also the longest hand in a clock, as we all know. Let us first put the minute hand at 12. We shall consider this to be 0 degrees. Now, as our minute hand moves, it reaches to 3 in 15 minutes and covers 90 degrees. Then it reaches 6 in another 15 minutes and has covered 180 degrees from the original position. Similarly, it travels to 9 in another 15 minutes and finally reaches back to 12 to complete an hour and a full 360 degree rotation. Obviously, it has covered 360 degrees in 60 minutes or 360 divided by 60 degrees in 1 minute and so its angular speed is 6 degrees per minute. Meaning is simple, the minute hand travels forward by 6 degrees in every minute. Now as we have established the angular speed of a minute hand, the angular speed of an hour hand should not be difficult. So the hour hand moves lower than the minute hand, clearly it travels to the immediate next number as hour passes or 12 to 1. 1 to 2, 2 to 3, which are 3 hours travelled and 90 degrees covered. Or let us say it travelled 30 degrees in an hour. Hence, the angular speed in this case will be 0 0.5 degrees a minute. Wonderful. Now, we have established what the angular speeds of a minute and hour hand are. Let us see a problem now. Let us say we need to find the angle between the minute hand and hour hand exactly at 15 minutes past 1. As you can see, the shorter hand is just ahead of 1 and the minute hand is at 3, showing 15 minutes now. We will calculate the angle of minute hand and hour hand from 12 o'clock position separately and will take their difference. So the angle of minute hand is 15 minutes into 6 degrees per minute which is the angular speed of the minute hand. This gives me 90 degrees from 12 o'clock which is the angle for a minute hand. Now coming to the angle of the hour hand. As we have already seen, for each hour completed, the hour hand travels 30 degrees. And for per minute, it travels 0 0.5 degrees. So we have 1 hour and 15 minutes. So the angle of the hour hand must be 30 degrees into 1 plus 0 0.5 into 15 minutes, which gives me 37.5 degrees. Now we just need to take the difference between the angle of hour hand and the angle of minute hand which is 90 degrees minus 37.5 degrees giving me 52.5 degrees. I hope you are following. Remember this difference could be negative sometimes as well depending upon the position of hands. But you have to consider only the positive value by taking the mod. Also if angle is greater than 180 degrees. Subtract it from 360 degrees to get an angle less than 180 degrees if required. Now let us come to the problem I asked at the start of the video. Find the angle between the hands at 40 minutes past 5. We can do the similar operation here as well. For angle of a minute hand, we will do 6 into 40 minus in bracket 5 into 30 plus 40 into 0 0.5. Inside the bracket, we have the calculation for the angle of the hour hand. Solving this, we get the angle of the minute hand as 240 degrees and the angle of the hour hand from the 12 o'clock position as 150 degrees plus 20 degrees, which we are subtracting from 240 degrees. So here we get the correct answer as 70 degrees. Sometimes you will be asked a reverse question. You will be provided with the existing angle and then you will be asked what is the time. Then consider time to be m minutes past h hours. Use equation mod of 5.5 m minus 30 h equals to angle a 
और मॉड ऑफ 5.5 एम माइनस थर्टी एच इक्वल टू थ्री सिक्सटी डिग्रीज माइनस ए टू सेट अपन ऑफ द इक्वेशन अदर इक्वेशन विल हैव टू बी मॉडल थ्रू एडिशनल इन्फॉर्मेशन विच विल बी गिवन इन द प्रॉब्लम इट इज एडवाइजेबल टू विजुअलाइज द टाइम इन द क्लॉक एंड ड्रॉ इट वाइल सॉल्विंग सच प्रॉब्लम नाउ आई वॉन्ट यू टू डू वन मोर एक्सरसाइज नोट डाउन द करेंट टाइम एंड कैलकुलेट द एंगल बिटवीन द क्लॉक हैंड्स फॉर दैट टाइम एंड राइट डाउन इन द कमेंट सेक्शन I will give you thumbs up for the correct answers. Also, subscribe to the channel to keep watching more such videos on Ed Sharpner. Keep sharing and keep encouraging us. We will meet soon again. Tab tak ke liye yaan pite rahiye.